team and then with the save, Bristleback's low and in comes Sumail, ball lightning down, he'll take it to Bristleback, need to jump again, March, there's no fissure about he's already thrown out, Femi comes the entire Eclipse, Sumail will go into March, the double kill for Sumail, Nuts on the retreat back behind the tower, the Soul Ring pops again, so Nuts in front of him, Soul's rounding around and now he's going to go down, and he just ran a bird perfectly, as you said, regeneration rune was fueling the fire of the Soul Spirit. And, I mean, <laughs> what do you have to say about that fight so far? And he's actually going bottom for this Q O yeah, Ember Spirit, was and he's so actually going to get sipped in from the top. Oh! Oh! We're playing Lord Mower Storm Spirit. That's can catch a big, this. big kill. Moving down further into PPD. Fear, he has a clip, but does he really want to do this? Now he does. Q O has jumped up. Universe goes for the dunk too early. Samael is brought back. He's seeping in. They want to try and get some counter kills, and there's your jump in. Orchid over on the Earth Shaker. No echo save. He's going to pop from this. Same with Nuts and Storm Spirit dragging Femi up and leaving him stranded on the hill. Great fight. It feels like the responsible dad. He's like, okay, guys, we got to take these towers down. Jump. There it is on QO. Owie. Damn! That Lacuna Blade just burns through him over, over KP. They're going to get the last record rate too. The Death Ward is going to go to work, but how much damage is it really doing? Universe takes a little bit of tick, but Storm Spirit. He's got Aegis Immortal slot up his sleeve, so jumping in again. There's your Echo Slave from March, but the damage is negligible. Fear turns on the Eclipse. He's looking for more than just the Earthshaker. He's gonna get nuts and then into Febby. He's running back to Tier 3 Tower. GG, 29 minutes. Evil geniuses. It feels like almost luring him into the fountain with no mana is the only way they're going to stop this guy. Yeah, and right now, Will might attack. be the target. Oh, dear, the ice goes right. That was his play. Fisher on the three, and Will's actually stuck. Blown up by the mail. Now he focuses on the element. Locking him in. The snowball actually hits the mail, pops him up in the air with the wall. with punch, but it doesn't matter. He's actually still looking very healthy, God. Fighting up against the here, but there goes all his damage. The mail dodges another stop. Finishes up one, gets a third. TK follows the next target. Oh, Holy Oh, Ultra Kill and to BP! There's the call it before Samel can go for the total wipe! Once again, marching in, how do they take this fight? EG will try, and oh. Samel! He got all five, but where's the follow? Do they have it? Do they have the damage? It seems they might! Finally a stun, but EG hanging on a hope and a prayer! Keeps them in the game, at least for now. Five man electric vortex. They know there's no super the and perhaps NP just say screw it and commit. They don't have to fight against as many eggs this time. Envy, for what it's worth, has a butterfly, but again, so now he gets every single one aside from a lone survivor. Lips away at EG. They find the opening. It's over. It's J. So many brambles, now silence, Carl's in trouble, Samael is here to finish him off, the Ravage comes just a bit too late, they might be able to finish off Seb, they will, but it's going to be costing them two at least, now they get the duel off, but Samael, he's just going to keep on swinging on these heroes, they are getting torn apart by 23 Savage and kind of rattled a little bit, Samael has nowhere to go, so he's just going to commit for the kill on a Cuckoo, oh and God. continue challenging, 23 Savage is up <laughs> no. next, now the Doom has faded away, so he can throw out the Avalanche, and oh, oh Jesus, my God. Oh my God. Ultra kill, Let's Rampage go. on the way for Samael. The king is big and back in play here at TI. Rampage for Samael and T1 are not going to call it's it just quit. They're going to be oh able to my God, God, double, rampage. double rampage for him. Give him the triple perhaps. Soxa helping him out trying to keep Cuckoo in place here and T1 are going to call it here. They get the kill on Soxa first triple? and that is it. Triple rampage. Samael finally gets it. LGD Committee of Global only getting a dazzle. EG still finding pretty solid trades. And now with Black Hole and BKB online, they're going in. Looks for AUI to turn this. Find Silar, but he's BKB. He's not taking damage. And Fierce Trap pretty far back. Can they bring them down? Rocket Barrage doing the work they need. LGD turning this. Sumail waiting. He's got no Laguna left. He already chucked it out and now can't really do the damage on his own. Trapped in the trees. Yeah, he's going to fall. Here, fights more. They're going to get the Earth Shaker too. Four. Dead, possibly five, and then one on the run. No escape, no mercy. He'll die as well, and it's an ultra for the young Sumer. They're in a decent position, oh, but they allow the EG. He's got they the allow hooks. EG to breach, and now they go in. The hook to counter, though. A beautiful catch by Xiao Wei, holding them in position. Sumail throwing himself up in the air, trying to survive. Now the volley for maybe. He's found the opening. Where's that black hole? Still holding it. Let it go. 
but it's cancelled immediately. There's the global. AUI is going to fall. Silar is going to drop next. Maybe could potentially join him as Yao does what he can against Sumail. It's not quite enough. Now they use him again. Where's that stun? They get it. And he's down. Not finished. He's out. He's out for 63 seconds with no gyro for 110. EG have done it. They have taken game one here against LGD. Or we've seen it. Ti never say never. In comes no Telltale. Tell runs into uh, him. Well, that's not how you want the fight to start. Not with three heroes getting locked down with the torrent storm combo. And Sumail first of all, can he do the damage? Stands his ground with the call down, but Matumba man muscling his way through him. They try to save him with so They get off the stun. No tell with the save, but Sumail, he's got to get out. He doesn't have satanic, or does he? No, he's been decrept. He's got to back away. Soxa keeps healing him. Wow. He survives. They did have to use a buyback there, but in no tell with the carapace again. So many interruptions. It doesn't seem to matter as Matumba still has Aegis. He's got the Illusionist Cape too. Charges forward, looking for the no tail kill again. Can they get it? Burrow straight forward, looking for the commitment. Seb still holding on to that epicenter. Not that it matters all that much as Gyro decrypt again, healed again. Is it going to be enough? Sumail, Satanic in one second. Can he get it off? He can. The Burrow through. He holds oh, his ground. He's doing it. No way. Sumail, he's gotten three. PL is coming back. Nisha's on the he's run. He can him. force him down. That's four. Matumba's the last man standing. Can they kill him off? Decrep, suck, stun. He gets off the epistle. He charges the other way. Matumba trying to find the kills. Where are they? They're nowhere. Oh, the it's the Chen stun follow up with the net. They're going to do it. They get all five. Oh, Holy way. shit. What's going on, OG? Dude. And still a 30k gold lead. And it feels like Secret are one bad fight away from losing this game. Yep. Nobody has buyback except for Seb. you got to kill the backline. They're going secret. for the throne or thinking about it. You need they a head in. Mail. Tier 4. They do torrent him once, but can they kill him off? Everything slowly being lobbed at him, but the buildings, they're not dying slowly at all. They're dying very quickly. As Matumba Man chased on the Soxa, can he burst him in time? He's ignoring he, the fight. No, he can't kill He's him off. He's the melody. Oh, the Decrepify. Sumail's ending the game. OG going for the jugular. Can they do it? Keeping the, ta the throne alive for now, but Puppy standing his ground. Look at it go. There's the torrent. It's too much regen. The torrent storm coming through. Sumail still full HP. It's an echo. They're throwing everything. The kitchen sink. The refrigerator. He's the oven. The it doesn't matter. OG will not be denied. Four heroes dead. It's going to be five. It's a wipe. It's an ultra kill. But they, they played this really well, and they're oh. to respond to it. Sumail, Excalibur's got the opening. Sumail will turn with the star. He flipped the star breaker damage. He oh just killed my the ball, pretty much. He's going to be able to get Gorg as well there with the help of GH. <laughs> uh, a, a gank gone wrong there. They call and it. They called it after that one. Respect for Sumail. They tap out. Nightfall shifts into that mid lane. They've got a morphling illusion from the wall to play with too. Jackal does not connect. They focus fire on the Dawnbreaker. Nightfall straight into the mix behind the tier four. Sumail barely waveforms away. Great Gloop near out from Thompson, but. The little piggy spinning around while Seb, Epicenter Burrow, kills off the two supports and Sumail gets a double kill. Off the back of no Seb mana. stuns. And they need to run down the mid lane, also double damage. They start trending in towards that, but two man, where's that? Two man vacuum and the wall, no real follow through. I was expecting a bit more there. Gale Force causing some issues. Sam and Thompson make the play in towards them. Can they them. blow him up? Yes, yes they Dark can. Dark going to die in Nightfall's fallen as well. They blow up two cores. No buyback on Nightfall and saves in trouble as well. The epicenter of Double Burrow gives triple kill to Seb. That, that's game. They, they don't have the buybacks on these heroes. 35 to 53. They were down like 20 kills and now they're winning. Victories within sight. DM tries, he's got a BKB up and GPK zips in, but what can a Storm do on his own? Absolutely nothing. He's stunned, he's disabled, DM's gone. Gary, when it's time to call it, it is time to call it's it. It's GG. Man, what a comeback from OG in this game. This is why Dota is such a beautiful game. I mean, I have watched the other esports, but this is why... This Warlock... Ehome going to be incredibly satisfied, but they want to keep pushing forward. They know that this Void and this Axe can't help out. If they can catch the mail, more PPD. There's going to be another hero with no buyback. The disruption save from Zai. Can they get PPD out? He gets a voice tap away, but no! The extra damage comes down from the Warlock as the Fatal Bonds eliminates him. But Zai, Zai, Zai! People with Zai, they're there to play the Dragon! Zai gets them! They hold! Mega Creeps incoming, but Evil Geniuses will stand strong for now. Start coming in as Ice 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 revives.
AGG, what are they looking for? He initiates and comes out out of fear. Refresher activated by Old 11, not gonna get the chance for a second by Lorar. He's gonna get blown up inside the corner sphere. He's down and out. Evil Genius is still five up, but here comes that on these flash. Bouncing around with the Shadow Demon. Hoping to be able to go on his eye, but an arrow! Oh my god! The nail just nailed him, but he still managed to get himself away in the back right. It's Spaceless Boy going the back. He's down, he's now gonna go for all the chicken. He's gonna be activated. And now he's gonna run himself away. Universe says he's back on the back right side of the he might be able to do this! This is their whole thing! Oh my god, he's all They know! They know Chicken's going for the all of Flame Seven! He's back at the Radiant Space! He's already taken down one of the tier fours! And he's trying to get PPT, but Evil Genius is cool, calm, and collected. They're holding the defense here against the Chicken. Chicken's going to be able to get the Five down! One buyback, and that's only the Warlock! It's only Mega Creeps and Warlock who could defend. Yeah, fear coming up as well. The tier four is being beaten on it. Begins the jump board. The man is about to go on the fan rear. No piano golf ring and I'm flying to dang it first. He'll take him out. He holds the fan rear by the tier The throw is going down. The throw is down at the face. He holds the fan rear. Next patch. Oh. There we go. Are you looking for the fight? But crit. Oh no, no one's gonna be so careful. Look at the water. No one. Oh no, not the rapier. Look at the disruptive attack. Then the back. Look at the cross. No one turns around. Don't even have the ultimate. He has the ultimate. He's down. No one hits the deck. They've lost Lil as well. Round the scene is gonna be dropped. EG. Oh, and then the boy has just done it here, and they have. GG is gone. That one on the high ground. EP was not prepared for that. Tunnel visioning on that one hero gives him so much space. Dude, Sumail is just no cares right now. He's just playing so aggressive. He just jumps straight up onto the high ground. He's gonna try and force some spells here out of Roger. Dude, the screams the side. What is this? Sumail! He does not care. He's gonna get the kill here as well on the Miro. Dude, he's got an right. Aegis to play with, a Lincolns as well. Dude, they actually clumped up for just, like, just barely within range of each other to trigger the double scream. Yeah, it's painful, that Ags. Especially right now with no real Auras to play with. Dude, he is just playing so aggressive. As he's looking for more, they get oh the duel God. Up onto Kiyotaka, and he is just instantly dead. He's gonna buy back in the game as Wukong's command is there. Monet doing what he can. Roger forced the egg before he dies, but Monet will focus it on down, and. You have Lost Ramses as well. That's going to be a dieback as Kiyotaka doing his best to survive this one. But the GG comes out rightfully so as it is all over for the side of Nine Pandas. Beautiful game here from the side of Aster and tips out for Sumail. This man deserves it.